Praise the Lord. I believe everybody will be praying along with me. You can see how struggling it is. And uh, I have some of you who have finished that. Let's say I can help. I will help. I pray that God will help every one of us in Jesus' name. As um, I've been saying, it has been a challenge uh, to be the only one coordinating the church. And that's why you will not leave me alone. That's why I do. I only want to see every one of you in the church. Um, as I said, what will be the best for me is to come from home, from work. Uh, is to come from work, come to the church, come and prepare the church. And then let's say I have another car, I give to Sandy. The Sandy will go and pick people. Sandy will just, you know, that would have been the easier. So by the time before he, he brings people, I will have settled everything down. So, so that's the challenges I'm facing. I can with me, I started high school now. His attention is being drawn away little by little uh, uh, to the school. And I've been observing it. And there's nothing I can do. Uh, he needs to concentrate on his academics. So you just need to be... You need to be praying for me. You see that before all this thing has been done, but now it is when I come here, they remember that, oh, this thing has not been done, this thing has not been done. So I need your prayer. I need your support. I don't want anything to distract us from the work of God. Devil, devil will be trying all levels to bring some things that look like they are good thing. They are beautiful. As I said yesterday, there's nothing good thing more than the word of God. There's nothing good thing more than the work of God. And then, uh, whatsoever God has been building, Through us, we should be half one hundred percent focus on it. God first, any other thing second. God first, any other thing second. Uh, never thinking that what you have been doing the your presence the little contribution uh you are doing contribute to the life of many people uh, how many of us are what's up apart from working me mommy gracia is not on what's up you are not on what's up what's up you are not there the group they call what's up you are not there. okay let's say many of us we are in that group you have known what our church means. How people are praying, how people are presenting prayer requests, and then a lot of things like that. I can go and bring my phone upstairs so that I will. Yeah, no. Let us stop all those. Uh, Things uh, like that's what I'm saying. Let us stop all those personal interaction uh, out of the church. God will help us in Jesus' name. Uh, bring the WhatsApp. I want to read it to mommy, uh, all of us, though that we can. 
I want to let you know how people are presenting prayer requests to this church, but that many of us we do not know. Look, look one prayer request, they write to this church. I just want you to know how people recognize us. Please, pray for me. I have been indoors for about two months due to eight challenge. But tomorrow being Monday, I want to resume back to work. Please, pray that every obstacle, God should clear them off my way. And that affliction will not raise the second time again in Jesus' name. Somebody wrote that one from somewhere to us to pray about. So that's how you will know how important the church. We may be looking at us, you know, I've been telling us many times, the way we look at ourselves is not the way the world is looking at us. And that's why I don't want us to get tired to get fed up uh, look at another prayer to request to us i want you to know bless the name of the almighty god with with me my only daughter mary at last on september 11th help me to pray for a conducive weather and a successful celebration. Another person wrote that one to us that we should pray. If I don't tell you all this thing, you won't know a lot of things I'm handling that you don't know. But that is how important the church it is. That many of us we don't know. Just to I just I just wrote two for you. So uh uh, this is another one to let you know. The person that wrote the first one is Udu Ovivuri. I can't, that's the name. To let you know the name. The second one that wrote, the second one that wrote, the Lord be with you. Uh, so that you will know that uh, the second person, I couldn't see this. The name of the second person is Ninwado Ezekiel. You have never met those people, but they know how powerful the church in Charlotte is. So, yeah, there's another prayer request I will read for you now. I just saw one now. He said, This does not, this one put Jemima, say, it is put Jemima. Say, good afternoon, brethren. Please join me in prayer for revival in all aspects of my life. That's another prayer request they wrote to us. So that's how big your church is that you don't know. When we come like this, you just look at us like we are few, but the work God is doing through us is marvelous. And then, in that case, devil too will be trying to do one thing or the other to cause this attraction. You get what I'm saying? So that we look, because if there's a unity within us, I will not be able to concentrate. Then the church will not be like the church is. Then. When everything falls apart, the strength will not hold. Keep praying. Keep praying. And the, the Bible says, What I tell the other, I tell you. Watch. So God will help us in Jesus. I always tell us all this word of encouragement 
so that when you see us we are no more than 10 you say oh we uh, i told you on youtube we have more than 14,500 subscriber on this prayer list we have more than 257 people on this prayer list at on facebook we have more than 10,000 people add all those things together and that's what the god was telling the prophet that what did you see the serpent said i see nothing go again what did you see i said go again by the time he he see the uh the warrior from heaven you know that so if you things we are not seeing it's more than things we are saying so please I want to encourage us again for Christ's sake. God is using us mighty fully. You may not know. You may not know. So, and the, the grace of the Lord will be upon every one of us in Jesus' name. Let us continue to walk in unity. When there's a division, there's a problem in the center. So I'm employing once again, please, the grace of the Lord will be sufficient to us. The mighty hand of the Lord will be for, for sufficient. Let us be focused. Every day, Janet Kennedy said, instead of thinking of what America will do for me, I think of what I will do for America. So instead of thinking of what the Pala Bible Church will do for me, I'm thinking of what I will do for the Pala Bible Church of Charlotte. And then through that, by the power in the blood of Jesus Christ, God will continue to empower us and the grace of the Lord will be sufficient for us in Jesus' name. Let us pray. Our mighty Father, we glorify your name. We thank you, Lord, because you are King of kings, the Lord of lords, the mighty one in battle. We thank you, Lord, because of what you are doing for us and what you will still continue to do. Father, we are here this morning, we pray. By the power and the blood of Jesus Christ, you will listen to our cry. You will listen to our, you will see our lamentation. And you will let your adorable man and of mercy accept us as we are father we pray by the power and the blood of jesus christ we shall not go empty handed in jesus name yes we may be view before you we are millions of millions i pray by the power and the blood of jesus christ mighty fully you will continue to use us in jesus name and the grace of the Lord will be sufficient for us. Thank you, O Lord, because you are the Lord that answer prayer. In Jesus' name we pray. Let's open our hymn to him 191. Him 191. We shall rest us to him 191. 